with one of my literally all-time favorite topics. <laughs> Getting organized is one thing, but staying organized that is a whole other thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so today, the home edits Clea Shira and Joanna Teplin are here with their simple steps to stay consistent with your decluttering goals. Please welcome Clea and Joanna. Good to see you guys. Thank you so for having me. So of here. course. So what's the number one mistake that people make when it comes to staying organized? Biting off more than they can chew. Absolutely. So you can do it in small steps and so it's not such a big overwhelming project and you just keep it going throughout your day and your life and your life is markedly better. So you're saying don't do your whole house in one week. Do weekend. not do that. <laughs> that will put you in paralysis. You <laughs> yeah, you'll be in the fetal position. Do not do that. So you guys have some simple solutions for us. We're going to go room by room. We're starting in the kitchen, kitchen drawers. This always becomes a problem for people. It That's is. right. Kitch kitchen drawers can be quite complicated, but they don't have to be. So we recommend using drawer inserts. We love like a drawer insert. Table. It's super easy and fit in most standardized drawers. And it really helps you keep everything categorized and contained. Containment is the key to having a, a long-term organized system. So oh. drawer inserts are your friend, categories are your friend, and contain get, everything. Get rid of duplicates. You don't need 12 bottle openers. You know, <laughs> it has you do. And if you do, no one does. No one needs 12. No judgment. If you do, that's fine. But we don't recommend it. I'm judging. <laughs> okay, so the next area we're going to talk about is your laundry area. Yes. This area I see people make pretty on Instagram all the time, but how do you make it where you can use it and it looks cute? Well, okay, first of all, we always start with function before we get to form, right? Always. We can make anything beautiful, but you have to think through smart systems. So laundry rooms are typically a little short on space, particularly in New York. And, oh, yeah. You know, I mean, if not... you got a laundry mm -hmm. machine in your house, you are winning. Right, right, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> so we want to think about adding storage where storage might not exist. Think floating shelves, over the door units. We floating love shelves, the back of the door. Right, exactly. Back of the door. And floating shelves are a beautiful way to actually add storage solutions to your space. And you can have canisters of your detergent, of your laundry pods, of dryer sheets. You can set it up looking Instagram worthy, but it actually is super functional. She said that. looking Instagram worthy. Everything is always about the IG, right? <laughs> yeah. But you well, got to so make it smart first. You got to yeah. make it smart. So what about, you know, of course, we live here in New York City and uh, some of the bigger major cities where your apartments are tiny. It's right. like a shoebox. That's right. What if you don't have a lot of space? Absolutely. We're always looking. And you want to separate your colors and all of that you stuff. You know what? Look for the walls. Usually people aren't utilizing vertical space, either under under shelves, under cabinets, or wall space. People just have, you know, pictures hanging on walls. You can put floating shelves on walls. You can also add a cart. We love a cart, particularly for hamper storage. So you can easily separate your color items, your whites. You can also uh, even do dirty laundry and clean laundry to be able to put things easily away afterwards. So a cart is your friend, always. Um, again, it's adding storage where storage didn't exist. Also, I'm hearing that categories theme. Again, oh, we love a category. Love a category. <laughs> always love a category. All right, we got to talk about the garage. Oh, let's do I that. I walked into <laughs> so many garages, you're like, what is happening? Yeah. There's no car in this garage. That's oh. right. Very commonly there yeah. are no cars. Don't ignore the garage. That's really prime real estate and mm -hmm. you want to make sure that you treat that like the rest of the home. Use clear bins with labels to make sure you know where your holiday decor is. Like why get Christmas down if it's Halloween? You know that will keep you super organized as you're going throughout the whole year. Right. Clear bins, vertical space, yes. you know add shelves. If your garage doesn't have shelves it's super simple to install garage uh, units. Units. Yeah. Thank you. Um, the container our store has a great one made by Alpha. It's fantastic. We love the Alpha one. Yes, mm -hmm. the Alpha system is amazing. It comes with drawers, shelves, you name it. You can configure however That's you right. want. Super customizable. Yeah, but the garage is not a throwaway zone. It is super valuable real estate. And think about what you need to have access to most often. So again, holiday decor. If you only get it out November 1st, it can sit at the top of That's the shelf. Right. You know, you don't need to have touch access for everything all at once. And it's so. not a junkyard. Don't right. treat it like such. <laughs> exactly. Which so many people, people they do. It. It's I know. really prime real estate. You're paying for that. Can you guys come home with me, please? Anytime. <laughs> Anytime. We're here. We have an yeah. amazing team in New York, in fact. <laughs> yes, exactly. Thank we'll we'll go organize your homes any day. So good to have you on. <laughs> Thank you for having us. We may take you up on that. <laughs> Big thanks to both of you for being here. And for more tips, check out their new book, The Home Edit Stay Organized, The Ultimate Guide to Making System Sticks. It's out today wherever books are sold. You're on. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching.
and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.